Hey, this is Jerry, lead mechanic at Evo, and today we're going to bleed some Abbott and SRAM brakes. So today for bleeding SRAM brakes, we're going to need isopropyl alcohol for cleaning, dot 5.1 fluid, two syringes, bleed block, T10 Torx, and a 5mm Allen for adjusting the brake. First step is removing the rear wheel. And using a 2.5mm Allen wrench to remove the brake pads. Then install your bleed block. Once we have our brake pads out and our bleed block in, you can use your T10 Torx to remove the bleed fitting screw. Next we're going to take our syringe and fill it up with dot 5.1 fluid. Then thread in our pre-filled syringe. First step in the SRAM bleed process is to bleed the air out of the caliper. I like to use a suction and compression method to help air bubbles rise to the top and out of the caliper. Once you've gotten all the bubbles out of the caliper, you're able to proceed to the next step. Once we've finished bleeding the caliper, we can now take our second empty syringe and our T10, level out the brake lever, remove the bleed fitting, and thread in the empty syringe. Once we have both syringes attached, make sure that your brake lever is above the caliper and begin to flush fluid through, keeping an eye on air bubbles coming out of the line and continue to push fluid through until no air bubbles are left. Once we have flushed the brake line itself, we can now remove the caliper side syringe, replace the bleed fitting bolt, and clean the caliper with rubbing alcohol and a rag to remove any excess fluid. Next step in the SRAM bleed process is to remove any remaining air bubbles from the lever itself. For that, we will use a compression and suction technique once more. Once all air bubbles have been removed from the brake lever, remove the syringe, replace the bleed screw, and clean excess fluid with rubbing alcohol. Once we have properly bled our SRAM brake, cleaned up any remaining fluid, we can now remove the bleed block, replace our brake pads, and install our rear wheel. If you have any questions, feel free to hit us up at evo.com or any of our locations.